Hi everyone, I'm Brendan McEnany, the Green Building Program Advisor for the City of Santa Monica. We're here today four blocks from the beach at an affordable housing project that's a collaboration between the City of Santa Monica and the Community Corporation of Santa Monica. Now this building is special. It's a green building that's achieved LEED Platinum Level Certification. That's the highest that you can get. We were lucky enough to join the construction team for a behind the scenes look at what special features went into this building to get that certification. Insulating the building is one of the most critical ways to save energy, yet insulation does all of its work hidden in the walls. Adding more insulation can help save more energy, but installing it properly is important too and is almost always overlooked. To be effective, insulation must touch all six sides of a cavity, top, bottom, front, back, and both sides, with no voids, gaps, or compressions. We also add insulation around the heating ducts so that the heat won't get lost before it gets to the room. Another place you'll find insulation is around hot water pipes. We insulate the pipes so they don't lose any heat between the water heater and the shower or sink where the hot water is used. Insulating the ceiling was a challenge on this project. It's tough to install fiberglass bats properly because they fall down. The team came up with a creative solution by installing the drywall first and then blowing in a fiberglass-based insulation product. Since the apartments don't have air conditioning, it's important to prevent heat from getting into the building in the first place. The roof is a cool roof. Its white color reflects solar radiation so that it won't make the building hot like a black asphalt roof would. In other parts of the roof, a green roof has been installed over the cool roof. This helps to additionally shade the roof, capture some stormwater, and it provides a bit of green space when viewed from the third floor walkway. Another hidden and underappreciated but important green strategy is air sealing, which is sealing cracks and holes in the walls to prevent air from getting in or getting out. Adding insulation without air sealing is like buying a thick winter coat that has a bunch of holes in it. When added up over the entire building, the tiniest gaps around windows, recessed can lights, and even between wall studs can lose a lot of conditioned air and energy out of the building. But in terms of the building form, two things in my mind are very important and they're free to everyone, and that is light and air. And so when we design projects, we start designing projects in a passive way with the climate using light and air. It makes the project a better project. It improves the quality of life for people who live here. And at the same time, it also reduces the energy load. Here in Santa Monica, blocks from the beach, we are lucky to have some of the best air quality around. So open windows and doors work just fine. Exhausting dirty air is just as important. Water heaters burn natural gas, which can create toxic carbon monoxide. Showers generate a lot of humid air, which can cause mold. Even ovens and stoves generate oil and grease in the air. Open the cabinets over a typical range top, and you'll see that the fan exhausts to the cabinets above. In these units, the dirty air from cooking is exhausted directly to the outside of the building. Building Green is really central to CCSM's mission. It's in our mission statement that we help improve the economic opportunity for our residents. So by living in a green building, tenants can lower their utility expenses, what they spend on gas, water, and electricity. So it allows them to spend more on other essential things like health care and education. And through education especially, they can improve their economic opportunity. One of the requirements of the LEED certification is to protect the building during construction from contamination. On this project, you'll notice that the building materials are protected from moisture and that all the heating ducts are covered so no construction dust can get into them. One of the functions of walls in a building is to protect the building from water and moisture. Plywood goes over the studs and then two layers of a special paper are added that blocks water but allows vapor to dry. Two coats of stucco are applied to finish the wall. Any penetrations from nails or screws or windows or plumbing are caulked and sealed to ensure that no water can get inside the building where it can cause mold. Thanks again for joining us today on this LEED Platinum affordable housing project. This project demonstrates that by using simple basic technologies and high quality construction, you can build to a high level of green at an affordable cost. The project's beautiful, we hope you've enjoyed it, and we'll see you on the next one.